Sometimes I'll just call him. All right, what's good, everybody on YouTube? It's your boy Moody. It's your girl Naveen. And look, y'all already know from the title and the thumbnail, we picking up these Palominos today, AKA the Mocha 2.0s. We got, I think we're picking six, up. Six, four? We, we got six in total, but we're picking up four from JD. You know, JD be blessing your boy on the channel. If you haven't seen my other videos, go check them out. We got a couple runs we gonna make today uh, outside of the sneaker run. So we gonna take y'all along with us. And then yeah, let's go pick up these shoes. We not gonna hold y'all up. So let's go. So we went ahead and grabbed them, picked them pairs up. So now we about to head to lunch. Cause every time we out this way, you gotta have long corn. Cause this is, is it is the one next to us or no? No, the, the closest one to us is like 25 minutes away, but that's with tolls. Yeah, and so, so it's not really feasible. So we either come here or we're Captain Crawfish and Captain Crawfish is seafood. I don't want nothing too heavy on my stomach right now. It'd be like butter, garlic. Y'all know how seafood boil is, and I'm just. Yeah. So when it's convenient, when we already got to come out here to get shoes. Yeah. We go ahead and make that stop. So we're going to eat long corn, enjoy that, and we're going to get back to the crib, talk about these shoes, see what they look like. And then, yeah, we're going to wrap this video up, let y'all go about y'all day. So let's go ahead and go. So now we are back at the crib and as you can see we got that package secure baby and I want to give JD Sports a big shout out just for destroying my box every single corner is ripped outside of that one you know just just completely dominated it like you know Shout out JD Sports, I appreciate y'all for just destroying my box. But anyways, I'd rather have a destroyed box than not getting the pair at all. But y'all see the Palomino Jordan 1s. I just want y'all to get a good look at those. The brown, I could really say, is like a nice, it's kind of like a lighter brown. It's not exactly like the Mochas, and I actually do have to run and grab those. But luckily, I was fortunate enough to be able to get plenty of pairs of these. You know, I had to, I had to do the double up shouting, but you know, and then I had to get wifey her pair because, you know, it's just too good to pass up. That brown and the black, basically bread color blocking, but with mocha hints, you really can't go wrong with that. I know I kind of griped about the box earlier, here. but you know the box is nice if you can get another one I do have a pair coming in the mail hopefully that box isn't completely destroyed but it's all black with hints of gold everywhere because you'll see hints of gold on the actual shoe itself on the tongue itself so that's where the gold is everything else is gonna be black brown and sale the outsole there is all brown let me grab the mochas real quick so we can do a real quick comparison all right so we got them the mochas here these came out i want to say was it 2020 october 2020 i only got one pair and it wasn't even my size whenever these actually released Oof. And these just still to this day look great. I'm not gonna hold y'all. I haven't had a chance to wear them yet because I don't really got too much brown in my collection no, or in my, in my wardrobe in general. Uh, so I really only have like blacks, but I mean, I could pull this off with all black. It's not that bad, but yeah, these came out 2020. So maybe three, four years ago, roughly. Uh, this is the last type of shoe that we've seen. And you know, whenever these first dropped, a lot of people compared the Travis Scott Jordan ones to them because they're brown, you know, a majority brown sneaker. But I want y'all to get in the comment section and y'all let me know what y'all feel like is the better version of the two. Do y'all like the Palomino? mocha jordan ones mocha 2.0s or y'all like the original mochas that came out a few years back i like both of them they're both staying in the collection because they're just they're both really good colorways you really can't go wrong with them but nowadays if you want to get this one looking at spending almost four or five hundred so i mean unless you get a used pair 
but these are still brand new. I haven't worn these at all. Outsoles are gonna be different. Black versus the brown outsole. I'm very excited, very happy that I did get my hands on these because this year, being real picky in what shoes that I wanted to keep as personals because there's so many that drop every single week. They had Mocha Dunks that came out, but they didn't come in my size, so I was like, these right here was gonna be the one shoe that I felt like was gonna be the best thing closest to it outside of these, you know, cause it's like, I only got one pair of these. I really don't like to mess them up. I like to keep my shoes clean. I don't wanna mess them up, so. But I got two pairs of these. So you know these is definitely gonna be on my feet. But y'all get in the comment section. Y'all let me know which one. Y'all like Palominos or y'all like the Mochas? I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all the, the gray school pairs because the gray school pairs did get a little bit of justice this time around. They they have really good materials on those as well. At least their box wasn't as neat as mine. But yeah, this is the leather and the suede. I, I don't know if it's a suede, new buck, whatever it is. This right here look looks good. It feels good to the touch. The leather, hmm, it's okay, but you can definitely smell that suede new buck type of material in the shoe itself it has a really strong smell of that whenever you open up the box <sighs> man with gray school pairs versus the men pairs qualities is really good so if you're a small foot person out there you will not be disappointed in these haven't seen too many complaints about the quality control but every pair will vary because they do mass produce these like i said y'all get down in the comment section y'all let me know how y'all feel about this colorway did you sleep on them uh do you already have the mocha so you feel like this really wasn't worth the purchase shoes do pile up and they do stack up over the years once you're a collector so y'all let me know if y'all got your hands on these were you able to get them for retail are you gonna have to pay resale not everybody could get a w today so y'all let me know about that i also want to know what y'all feel about the mocha the original release from 2020 y'all let me know in the comment section which one y'all feel like is better but it's your boy moody i'm gonna get on out of here y'all need to stay tuned because i am dropping our full wedding uh vlog when we had our ceremony in cancun so that video is coming out very very soon it's gonna be like 45 minutes to an hour but it's jam-packed with a whole bunch of great clips with friends and families from that whole entire week that we were down in cancun so if y'all want to check that out be sure to make sure you're subscribed to the channel and you have the notification notification bells on so you'll know as soon as that video drops and you can watch that video I also did post a reel of this shoe here uh, on Instagram TikTok and on YouTube shorts as well so y'all can also check that out but yeah outside of that that's it Palomino Jordan Jordan ones uh, you like them you hate them love them y'all let me know in the comment section but until then I'm gonna go ahead and see y'all in the next video appreciate y'all for tuning in yeah I'm gonna go ahead and get out of here y'all peace